Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, it's been a few days, um, so yeah, this weekend happened in the FCS world, yes, the Sweet 16 is still going on as we speak right now, go ahead, go watch Sweet 16, it's still some fun stuff right there, uh, but the FCS, unfortunately, I say this, you know, with most sadness, unfortunately, didn't get to see the game I wanted to see yesterday, which is kind of sad. And we got some cancellations, some big ones, some big ones yesterday. No North Dakota State game yesterday. Um, there was like a rain delay or something like that in the um, Alabama State Arkansas Pine Bluff game, and that game got canceled. And I believe one more game got canceled as well. So, yeah, there we go. San Diego, the team that I wanted to watch this weekend. They, they still are winning. They have, I believe, they've broken that streak of 40, 30-something straight conference victories in the conference. And now it's 40. The record is 40 now, I believe. So congrats to them. They are continuing to move on. Um, again, there was, some big, there was some big things yesterday. And, I mean, Nichols put up 75 on an incarnate word. Incarnate Word scored 45, but Nichols scored 75, so, oh boy, if, you, if somebody has to face one of those two teams in the postseason, it's going to be one hell of a fight, let me tell you that much. <clears throat> James Madison still winning, they beat William & Mary, you know, again, one of those teams that have been, you know, touted up as a number one team in the FCS, they take care of business out there. Big one yesterday, Weber State, Northern Arizona. What a damn good ending this was. I saw the last play. What a Hail Mary to end it. Weber was down, you know, six points. You know, or rather, they were down eight point, And they got the Hail Mary somehow. They got it off, and they got it in. And that's a big W for Weber State. Maybe it'll cement them as number one for right now. Uh, well... What else is there? Oh yeah, Austin P. The Governors, they got a huge victory. A huge victory against Jacksonville State. Oh my goodness. That's the first loss Jacksonville State has had in the FCS ranks this year. So, that's a big time victory for Austin P. honestly. I believe some other teams have finished up their seasons, like Dixie State. They finished up their season, I believe, yesterday. Easy victory against Fort Lewis. Um, some other teams should be finishing up this week as well. And surprisingly enough, we have games on, you know, on Thursday and Friday and Saturday and Sunday this week. So uh, my preview video will be earlier this week. It'll be Wednesday. You know, that's going to be fun. That's going to be very much a fun time there. Again, you know, teams are still, you know, still testing the waters, and there's only a couple weeks left in the season, if we're being honest with ourselves. There's only a couple weeks left, and, you know, things are just, things are getting even more crazy. You know, three weeks left now, and, you know, the playoffs are right around the corner. So, you know, it's going to be interesting to see what in the world happens these last three weeks of the season, so... <clears throat> so until then, um, I don't really have much else to say. You know, hopefully we can get some more FCS games on TV. They they have been ESPN has been announcing some to be on TV in the next couple weeks, but there needs to be more than that. Um, honestly, I mean that that's just the bottom line. You can't just have you know, SWAC be on TV. Well, Jackson State be on TV all the time. But ESPN should take it better. I, you know, better opportunities and a better advantage with this season. But, you know, it is what it is. Uh, but, yeah, I'll see you guys, you know, Wednesday for, you know, the FCS stuff. And Tuesday, yeah. You know, yeah, it'll be Tuesday or third. It'll probably be either be Tuesday night, you know, late Tuesday night. Or, you know, Actually, I think I'll only do one video for the national championship, for the college basketball national championship. Yeah, so there's that. Uh, yeah, 
that'll do it. See you guys.